Welcome back. Okay, so we made this fantastic main course to impress all your friends and it is easy to do, but that's not the only easy thing that easy, we're going to do easy, to impress easy. all of our friends. I mean, yeah, exactly. <laughs> we have so much up our, our sleeve. And, well, uh, and I do think having some ideas how to make things look nice that don't necessarily take the entire day. You work and you've got to clean the house and you got to get ready and some things that are a little easier. Yeah, and people drop by and you want to make, you know, you can jazz things up with everyday things and make it look like you worked forever and you know I'm a big believer when I go ice skating you know mm -hmm. I have no footwork so I make large sweeping <laughs> hand gestures and it's like look at her and she like, is so you know, good that, so like a that's Olympic kind of this is the equivalent to large sweeping hand gestures so you've got a simple Fair plate enough. of pasta right and you want to jazz it up right, which I didn't jazz bring it this way though so the camp member oh. root cam and last week <laughs> folks I had to have my roots done but now Root cam. Oh, no. I don't we know if they're taking cam, it. We have a yeah. chin cam, but you there know. There it is. Root cam. But I'm not Why? as heavy as I appear <laughs> on television. Well, as that I've is, been told. like you said, that's the double So you have, a, you have a plate of pasta that's simple, easy, and you want to jazz it up and impress your friends. Just line so, the rim. With olive, a oil little olive oil. Olive okay. oil. And you can use fresh herbs in this too. Maybe stagger a little. Really show them that you're, you know, doing something fun. Sprinkling says I care. It does. It just takes it, it's only about five minutes. You know, it takes what? Five seconds it's to It's like take the concept it to a, of our rimming our, our glass rim with exactly. the, you know, this is just the bowl. And we'll just use this as a little demo here. But another thing, this is one of my favorite pieces of equipment. The planer. Yes. Plus you can talk with it and say, you know, get your homework done at the same time. And, you know, it's really nice. But another thing you can do is, is just zesting is nice. See how it just adds a lot of color. So let's say you have, you know, what's really nice with the lime is if you have a, chicken dish you want to put in a bowl or you want to present. You can do this with a big platter too. And just with that lined, uh, a little bit of rim of olive oil and you've got this on there and it just takes it up a notch. It does and it smells so good too. I know a, we were talking about the smells today and, but. Right, so you put a plain little thing of pasta in there that you took 10 minutes to make. You whap it in this bowl. That's one of my favorite words in my teens, whap. I'm not exactly sure how we conjugate that, but we were going to whap the pasta in there. Whap and And uh, it's it's good to go. So that's one thing you that can do. That is one really, really good idea. Yeah. So, and another thing with this, this is wonderful too, is we can take other things up a notch. The doorbell rings. You've got, you know, I don't have a mother-in-law, but if I did, I would have this in my arsenal. <laughs> Look at this, two ninety nine special. You don't want to serve that. Oh, here, have a brownie. You know, right. so. This says, whatever, right. go home, get out of here. <laughs> Which is the way I do it. So let's so, do okay. this. Let's, you can take a, you can take a plate. You could, this, you could put this on a bigger platter. You could do them individually. But you take the little two ninety nine thing and just do a little drizzle. And doesn't that look better already? Voila. Add a couple berries, Aww. and you can do this on a, oh, I have, a, I have a, someone who's making a run for it there. Runaway lime. Runaway, a renegade lime. And that sounds like a band name, anyone? <laughs> yes? I love renegade lime. Put a little berry on there, and like I said, we're. Oh. Now this is, this, this is the Martha moment that's about to happen. <laughs> Stand back, strap in, here comes a Martha moment. This is a, my grandmother's tea uh, little infuser, but I use it for, um, you know, just do one of these deals and you've got yourself a nice little, get rid of the clump, you've got yourself a nice little presentation there. Do you all see that? that Which is, so is really beautiful. nice. Another thing I have on hand mm -hmm. in my pantry during the holidays mm -hmm. is um, these are dark chocolate covered coffee beans. And let me caution you, if you eat a fistful of these, you will be jittery. I'm telling you this because I know it to be really? true. Really? I just yes. I just throw a few in. And no, I just I'm saying if you think they're like M&Ms, oh, yeah. they are that tasty, but you will so, be like, yeah. Oh. Okay, Turkish coffee one day. So That's right. You today. talk really fast and you're <laughs> angry, but also really efficient. Well, this is a lovely little thing here. You can take um, coffee ice cream, mm -hmm. vanilla ice cream, any ice cream you have, soften it up on the counter a little bit or zap it if you want, but I like to soften it on the counter. Fold in your dark chocolate covered coffee bean and you've got a nice little gourmet treat again put a little berry on the side and you're good to go also um, what John did earlier with the crushed peppermint on the rim yeah that's also nice to use in the folded ice cream too so fold ingredients into just a simple ice cream in a pretty dish and you've got an instant oh my goodness they've dropped by kind of thing going on. <laughs> Another thing you can do too, which is I always keep on hand, is this handy dandy shaver. Uh, and you can, you know, shave chocolate, just get inventive, you know, but you can really take it up a notch. 
by doing some chocolate shavings on anything. And like I said, just these are just common everyday things, but it's a lot better than here have a brownie or here or have a little like I would do, throw it at treat. their head. Get out. <laughs> I work, I have to go to work. And here's a good one. Yeah. I, lo I can make these blindfolded, but you know, sometimes life happens. So if you have someone drop in, just get a simple frozen treat. And you can, um, like I said, this is kind of like, I don't know if you saw uh, How Does She Do That or whatever that movie was where she did something and put it in a pie thing. Mm -hmm. I'm not, I'm not above that. I'm and not above that. I have issues with that movie, but I... I had a ton of issues with that movie. I, I don't, mean, I, I think... I not all frazzled, you know, crazy well, people. Well, it was written, let me just say, side note, how does she, I don't know how she does it. It was written know. during a great economy when everyone could have a job and, you know, oh, I'll take this other job. Oh, no, exactly. I'll take this job. It, it then comes out when no one has a job and all she's doing is complaining about her high paying <laughs> yeah, job. It's like, hey, Sarah Jessica, I'll take that job. I'll take the job. I just want to eat. <laughs> <That's> right, <you laughs> know. So it totally didn't work. Exactly. On that level. And, you know, but it, the yes, shortcuts do the work. The shortcuts do work. And I, it's very pretty if you have to take something quick, but mm. you know, and just jazz it up with your own fruit. You can use blueberries, strawberries, whatever. And again, put this in, just, you know, put your little guy in the oven mm -hmm. and. You could put a couple of those on there too. Oh right? yeah, you could. Well, not during the baking process, I wouldn't. After, I don't, after you could, but uh, just put your own. And then again, which, like I said, single single momhood here. Quick. Oh mm -hmm. my gosh, I forgot something for the school thing. I do this quite a bit. And all right, where's that going on your? You can do. You're going to bake this, and then after, just kind of whip this around. And again, take pick a garnish, whatever one you want. You want to. Again, put this the drizzle plate, very pretty on there on the platter. And again, I just you I just want to show you what this looks like on the whipped cream. This is great. Right, on if you put too. it on top. All right, I'm going to bring John back in um, because we're going to try these. <laughs> Look at those four fantastic ideas, um, and we're going to try some of these cocktails Ooh. that John made for us. Now that we've got all of our um, all of our espresso beans in us. Going <laughs> to yeah. nullify that effect. Um, again, all of these recipes. We're, up, we're down. On <laughs> dot TV, and of course, you can follow Full Plate. Which one you want to try? All of them, right? I, yes. Follow Full Plate on <laughs> Facebook. Uh, Rebecca oh, Rainier's Full Plate, and we will link you to all of the different resources. Uh, Merry Christmas and Merry Happy, Christmas. New Happy New Year. Please oh. imbibe safely. Have a great time and. We may or may not have made them a home, but maybe wow. we didn't. Maybe we bought them. Wow, I think I first chest hair. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. All right, we'll happy new one. year. <laughs> All right. <laughs> this, is, this is tough. I love this. I love this one.